Welcome to the Defense and Aerospace Report. I'm Vago Maradian at the Paris Air Show at the historic airfield at Le Bourget, outside the French capital. Sponsors for our coverage here are L3 Technologies as well as Leonardo DRS. And we're over here at Raphael Advanced Defense Systems where we're talking to Yossi Horowitz, uh, who is uh, a marketing director uh, in the air superiority uh, systems business. Yossi, thanks for joining us. Thank you very much to hosting me. Um, so let's talk about Dome, uh, dome do, Drone Dome. dome. Uh, say that 10 times fast, then you're never going to make it. Um, you know, you guys specialize in air defense systems. Iron Dome is one of the things that you guys have, have, have brought to market, which is a revolutionary system. Talk to us about Drone Dome and how it works, because this is a currently ready to deploy both jammer and laser system that's counter drone. drone. Tell us about it. Okay, uh, as you mentioned, we developed the Iron Dome. Now came a new trait is the drones. It's very unique threat because it's everyone can operate it, can send it, it can be a toy and it can be a, a weapon system. So and really who is, uh, who is operating? Who is uh, in charge to defeat this one? Police or army? Let's, just, let's take example in uh, to, uh, Eiffel Tower there will be some drones who will allow to eat them down, no one knows. But we decide that we should come to this uh, business and to develop a new system that can detect and defeat this kind of threat in relative long ranges. And this is what we present here at the Paris Air Show. When you're looking at your system and you said relatively long ranges, there are other folks who've, who've, uh, who've uh, shown this capability for Boeing is one of the companies, for example, uh, whether at AUSA shows or Navy League shows, uh, you know, one of them in partnership with BAE Systems. Talk to us a little bit about what is different about your system, because the ranges you're talking about is in the kilometer or two range, as opposed to just a few hundred yards. Correct. First of all, uh, as you mentioned, I think that only Boeing and Rafael to, has some capabilities for what you call hard kill. But there is a lot of companies can offer a system that can detect the target, jam the target. But in the new uh, drones, maybe you cannot the drones them. Hey, you cannot jam them. Maybe they have some autopilot that can mean. So we develop the light beam. The light beam is the laser that allow us to defeat target in long range, which means 2.5, 3 kilometer uh, in front of the defended area. So most of the, the, cap the main capillary system that it can do it in long range in very fast. And if we are uh, firing in these ranges of 2.5 kilometer, and in its case there will be a swarm of uh, threat, we have time to slew from one target to another target. Just to give you some idea, we are talking about 100 meter between the first one to the second one. In between, we are firing, we are operating the gun, the laser gun. And, and your cycle rate is very fast because you're using a solid state rate laser. Correct, correct. And what is the, um, so the targeting system is integrated into it, so you have a phased array radar that's in the system as well. Yeah, we have a phased array, a phased array radar that can uh, cover 90 degree, 180 or 360 degree. This is the first element. The second element that we have is, is a common system. So in case there is communication between the operator to the, to the drones, we can detect the communication. So and then we can slew the camera toward the, the target. In between, we are detecting the frequency. We know which frequency that we can jam. But in case we cannot jam, we are slow, uh, the camera is already on the target. We are measuring the range to the target. And luck with a very narrow beam of electro-optical sensor and firing. By the way, this uh, uh, luck with a very narrow beam on the target it's the main safety feature that we have because we cannot fire unless 
the camera is luck on the target and we are talking about some very small penny at the distance of one kilometer. What's the power requirement for it? Because generally lasers do require a certain amount of power. How much power is required and how portable is it? I mean, you can see the size of the unit. It's actually pretty portable. Really, you can operate it in, uh, with a small generator, 24 volt uh, battery that are doing, and we are bringing five kilowatt uh, laser. How large of a market is this? Um, it would appear that, I mean, those folks who, the opponents of legalizing drones, this is one of the things they said is that they will someday be very, you know, it can carry a pizza or it can carry two pounds of explosives. The pizza you're looking forward to, the two pounds of explosives, maybe not. So, you know, how big of a market do you guys project this? Is this a billions of dollars market? And what's the estimated cost? Because it would seem to me that price point is very important here for a system like this. So what's the price point you're shooting at and what's the global market that you're shooting at? We are looking, we are thinking that the, in the global market, we're talking about something like three to five billion dollar market in the global market. But it's very unique uh, market because in one side it can be a military market or something, some place that you are defending that it's no problem to fire, you can do whatever you want. It's like to protect assets. In the other side, it's civilian. What is civilian? It could be prison, it can be uh, the prime minister house, it can be a stadium or some event, Olympic game, it can be a funeral of the king of uh, Thailand that will be in October. So really you need a system that it will be uh, in, one, uh, in one point very uh, mobile very lightweight that you can bring it and it should be low cost. We are talking really low cost system that the civilian uh, authorities can purchase it. But we are talking about a few million dollars for all the systems. And this is available starting when? Correct. This is a system that is ready to sell and to provide to the customer. Yossi, thanks very much and best of luck with the system. Thank you very much. So.